Hello good day viewers. In this tutorial we are going to solve this quadratic equation by factorization root 5x squared plus 2x minus 3 root 5 equal to 0. First step we should take the leading coefficient and multiply with the constant term that is root 5 multiplied by negative 3 root 5. This will give us negative 3 root 25 right? And root 25 is 5, and 5 times negative 3 will give us negative 15. So this is negative 15. Now we're going to think of two numbers, which when we multiply them together, we get negative 15. But when you add the two numbers together, you're going to get 2, which is the coefficient of x. And the numbers are 5 and negative 3. These are the two numbers you can multiply together to get negative 15. But when you add them together, you get 2. So we are going to replace the middle term, which is 2x, by 5x minus 3x, which are the same thing as 2x, right? So we have root 5x squared plus 5x minus 3x, then minus 3 root 5. This is equal to 0. Now we are going to factorize in batches the first two and the second two. Let's start with the first two. We can factor out root 5x right then inside you take the whole of this you divide by this let me take you step by step if you have root 5 x squared and you divide it by root 5 x you see root 5 will cancel root 5 and x squared divided by x will give us x so we have x here plus take this you divide by this you're going to obtain 5 divided by root 5 because x's will cancel right so we have 5 divided by root 5. Then you move to the second two terms. This, we have negative 3 in common, negative 3 outside, then inside. If you take this, you divide by this negative 3, which is outside, you're going to obtain positive x because negative 3 will cancel negative 3. Then you take this, you divide by this. The negative 3s will cancel, leaving positive root 5. So we have positive root 5. This is equal to 0. Now we have this. We are going to rationalize it. How can we do that? You're going to take 5 divided by root 5. You multiply the top and the bottom by root 5. I mean we are going to rationalize the denominator. To the top we have 5 multiplied by root 5. To the bottom we have root 5 times root 5 which is root 25 and root 25 is 5. You see, 5 will cancel 5. So the whole of this is nothing but root 5. So we have root 5x multiplied by x plus root 5, then minus 3 multiplied by x plus root 5. This is equal to 0. If you observe, the terms under the bracket are exactly the same. So we are going to factor one of them out. We have x plus root 5, multiply by root 5x minus 3. We have root 5x minus 3. The whole of this equal to 0. We are going to set the two factors to be equal to 0. Either x plus root 5 equal to 0 or root 5x minus 3 equal to 0. So from this equation, if you take root 5 to the other side, it becomes negative. So we have negative root 5. This is one of the solutions. Or x equal to, if negative 3 crosses over, it becomes positive. Then you divide by root 5. But you can also rationalize it by multiplying the top and the bottom by root 5. So x could either be equal to negative root 5 or x equal to um, to the top we have 3 root 5 and to the bottom we have root 5 times root 5 which is root 25 and root 25 is 5 square root of 25 so these are the two solutions x could either be negative root 5 or x equal to 3 root 5 divided by 5 and this is the solution to this problem thank you for watching do share it to your learning colleagues and don't forget to subscribe to my youtube channel for more exciting videos Bye-bye.